Yeah, I bought a brand new cutting board. I'm really excited about it. It's like this giant 100 pounds. No, not really 100 pounds. Super thick. Got it at TJ Maxx for $32. So I've been really needing a thick, nice cutting board. But that stupid sticker stuff is so sticky. And it's you can't see it, because I, but you can see it on my hand here. It's like so sticky and won't come off. I've already soaked this thing down and cl cleaned it really good. Um, but I wanted to show you what I use lemon essential oils for. So it's just lemon essential oil. This stuff will get rid of any goo, any gunk stuff. So I just use paper towel because I try to wipe off the gunk with it. But all I do is I just put a couple drops of essential oil here. I mean, I can use my fingers because it's, but let me see if I can show you here. It is just melting. And then I use, you can kind of see where, see where the sheen was. I just use um, paper towel to wipe away the melted gunk. Of course, someone would call me. And this gets all of the melted adhesive off with it. Uh, lemon is going to be totally fine, if not nourishing, for my cutting board. And let me put you back. And it's gone. Like, literally, completely gone. It smells amazing. All of the sticky adhesive is on my paper towel now. I just checked this out, and the lemon essential oil is now scented on my board. If I were to wash this with soap and water, it's probably going to come right off. But I don't have any goo gone or anything disgusting on my cutting board where my food is going to go. I'll excuse my children in the background yelling about Fortnite, but not in a single bit of not a single bit of adhesive left. Just beautiful conditioned wood. That's my two minute tip on how to use lemon essential oil. It's like one of my favorite oils. We will never be without it. Again, totally safe for me. Don't have to worry about it. I'll wash my hands just so I don't get my eyes. And um, It is photosensitive, so if you put it on your body and you go outside, it could discolor your skin a little bit. But for a cutting board, it's totally fine.